Problems like this aren't often due to a lack of pure strength, but rather stability, which limits force output. Let me explain why and two things you can do to fix problems like this. While the muscles on the front side of your body and your triceps are the main movers in a bench press, the muscles on the back side and deep within the shoulder are very important for maintaining efficiency of your lift. When one side of the bench press collapses, it's often because the muscles on the back side of that shoulder and deep within aren't working properly to stabilize the joint. Step one, find a mini band loop and perform some very slow tempo bench press. You can add pauses in in certain positions if you feel like there's any pain or you're not as stable, but five to 10 reps slowly like this. Step two, also warm up with an upside down kettlebell bench press for five to 10 reps. Making sure that the bell stays upside down requires you to be very stable in that shoulder.